Hospitals across the U.S. treat millions of patients each year, and sometimes that means stretching resources thin trying to ensure every patient is safe. Some are now turning to intelligent cameras and a network of Intel-based computers, all to make sure bedside manner really means someone's always virtually at your bedside. On the surface, it looks like merely a camera in a hospital room here in Baylor Medical Center at Frisco. One that helps Terry Lynn Hunter keep better track of patients from her nurse's workstation. It's really nice to be able to see what your patients are doing in any kind of crisis situation. One high tech enough to draw virtual bed rails, warning nurses if you're at risk to fall out of bed. They are moving to try and get out of bed. It will alarm and the virtual rails will flash. But beyond the obvious safety features, beyond even the family chat room and movie streaming functions that the CareView system adds as entertainment, it's something more. It's an example of the type of connected intelligence systems that generate business critical data and help enable the Internet of Things. CareView's Kyle Johnson says that data is the key to making hospitals run smoother, faster and safer. You could tailor to each individual hospital down to each individual floor. It all and depends on how much the hospital really wants work with the product. Our system gathers a, a great deal of analytic data. That information there is compiled and then sent across the existing coaxial network inside of the hospital down to the hospital servers that are located at every hospital. From the hospital servers, the nursing stations can all access that same information. The hospital staff can log in and access that information along with all of our mobile products then wirelessly you can tie back into our system there at the hospital. That's all fed back into our servers here and into our offsite servers as well. A computer connected to each camera keeps tabs on things like how fast nurses respond to a room, even if a patient needs to be turned to prevent bed sores. So the system alerts nurses to when the patient should be turned in the bed and also provides a complete audit trail validating that the, the care was given. Baylor's one of nearly a hundred hospitals around the country using CareView to find ways to save money and save lives. We don't do any overhead paging in the hospital, so it's very nice we can look in and try to find the doctors and nurses and not really disturb the patients. And it's a wonderful opportunity too for family and friends that are not here, that are worried about their loved ones, they can use it as a webcam. Of course, for many of us who already feel vulnerable during a hospital stay, privacy is a big deal, and a camera staring at you may not help that feeling. That's why CareView password protects its systems on both the patient and provider sides. It also allows patients to set up a virtual privacy screen when a little confidentiality is what you need. Terry Lynn Hunter, though, says with a little education, most patients quickly warm up to the idea of a vigilant hospital assistant. Actually, it comforts them to know that they're completely 100% monitored even when we're not in the room. And we're merely scratching the surface of what CareView can do. For example, the cameras allow new parents to monitor premature infants from home, something that can help alleviate the stress of having to leave a newborn in the hospital. We keep really tiny babies for days, weeks, and sometimes months. So it really is a, a very stressful time. Being able to watch the baby and bond with the baby in a virtual setting um, is a wonderful thing. CareView says they have plans to connect their system to another 20,000 hospital rooms across the country. So the next time a loved one is in the hospital, look for these high-tech options for staying in touch and enhancing safety. For Tech Today, I'm Owen Lang.